What is up guys, Jason here and on today's video I'm going to teach you how to record your gameplay from your VR headset to your PC. Uh, this is going to be like a, a vlog kind of video. Um, I prefer to do it like this because it's much more personal. You know, I get to like put some jokes and stuff in, just chime in. But if you guys like these kind of videos, uh, be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. And yeah, let's get right into it. Now there's two ways you can link your Oculus to your computer, and one is by AirLink, which operates over Wi-Fi, or two, you can go the standard route by getting this long cable, okay? Now, I prefer to use the cable because, for one, there's no compromises, you don't get much lag. If, for instance, your internet, um, there's a lot of people using the internet, and you start lagging. <laughs> I don't like that, so. Once you use the cable, uh, this is how it looks. Uh, you got your normal uh, type C, I guess, and you got your USB uh, 3.0 right there that goes into the computer. But basically, uh, with the cable, there's no lag really. Um, there's less stress and so forth. But anyways, getting into the video, <laughs> it's better to use the cable. You can get these off of Amazon for like 16, 20 bucks maybe. Uh, a really good one, I think, is like $79, but hey, I prefer to use something that works. This one, I think I got this one for, if I'm not mistaken, I got this one for 20 bucks. But yeah. Alright, so we're gonna plug this bad boy in into our main PC right here. I always fumble like plugging in USBs for some reason. And we're gonna grab our Oculus. As you can see right here, we got our little USB-C uh, slot. You want to put it right there, backwards like that. And then there's a little like strap. Wait, where is it? I lost the strap thing. There was like a strap to like hold the wire to this right here so that it doesn't like uh, pull too much. But I seem to misplace that strap. Anyways, once you link, once you plug your USB thingy in, uh, there's gonna be, okay, actually, coming over here to the computer, you need a software on your PC. Oh, here you can see all the cables on Amazon. Um, you need a software on your PC called, what's it called again? All right, so you need the Oculus software, and I'm, of course, I'm gonna put this, the uh, link in the description down below. Um, install the Oculus software, uh, make sure you sign up and all that good stuff. And it should look a little bit like this. You got your home, your store, uh, library events, and so forth. Um, getting it linked to the computer, uh, you're gonna go to devices. As you can see, um, I already had this linked, so it's kind of like there already. But you'll plug it in, and then um, you'll see the device pop up, and then you can hit, you know, connect. But uh, on your headset, you're, there's gonna be like a little prompt. Uh, of course, I can't show you it. I can only, I'm gonna try to put uh, a picture to, to uh, demonstrate on screen how you do that. Uh, there's gonna be a prompt inside your headset that you have to click to uh, actually link it together. But anyways, um, it says allow connected device to access files and inside the headset, I wish you guys could see this. I'm gonna click allow. And once I click allow, right? Uh, click enable link. It's loading at the moment. All right, so now it's definitely connected. Um, let me see if I can mirror now, okay? All right, so there's two ways to mirror your gameplay uh, on the Oculus with, when it comes to your PC. Um, when, when you have the Oculus software installed, all you gotta do is just launch a game from your PC and everything should work. And I'm gonna show you that right now. Uh, let's open VR chat. All right. So just like that, VR chat is enabled. Well, launched. <laughs> Let me stand over here and go. All right, and as you can see, I'm looking around 
And just as it is on the desktop online, it's loading. Oh, there we go. All right, so I can see my hands. <laughs> can you see me? I can see my hands. But uh, yeah, I can look around and everything is there. Awesome. Okay, so that's how you link your headset. Um, uh, just by launching the game from the library on your PC, from the Oculus software. But there's also another way. Um, there's another way to like mirror everything. Wow, this game is beautiful, not gonna lie. <laughs> there's another way to mirror everything on uh, the Oculus instead of just the games. Um, I'm gonna demonstrate that in a second, but in order to record your gameplay, of course you gotta use a, game, uh, a recording software. Um, and for this uh, example, we're using Streamlabs OBS. I'll also link, link a, uh, a video in the description on how to set up Streamlabs OBS to do your recording and stuff. All right, so yeah, it's a perfect mirror right now. Streamlabs, is, I'm not recording on it, but in fact, let me do record. <laughs> and then I'll show you the gameplay. Um, but yeah, Streamlabs is recording right now. There's another way to link uh, the Oculus to your computer, and I'm gonna show that right now. I'm gonna demonstrate that. Let me just close this. Oh wait, I need to close it from your side again. Oh, there we go. All right, so this one is a little bit more technical. There is a, uh, there is a folder where your game is installed on your C drive. Um, just go to this PC. Go to C drive. Uh, I think it's uh, I think it's in program 86. Either way, you want to look for the um, Oculus software folder. I think it's pro in program files. Uh, oh, right here it says Oculus. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna use a recording from my computer so you guys can see it clearer. <coughs> Excuse me. But inside the Oculus software, uh, there's a couple folders. Uh, you want to go to, I think it was software. And software, no, I don't think it was software actually. I think it was support. And then you want to go to Oculus. Uh, oh yeah, it's di diagnostics. <laughs> Oculus diagnostics and then Oculus mirror right here. So once you open that, it'll just generate a, just a tab. And you can see, of course you can see the desktop app and you can see my knuckles over here. I can move them, they turn into hands. <laughs> but uh, this is a way to mirror everything that's on your screen. Um, so as you can see, it's full screen on the desktop um, and on the Oculus it's full screen too. So if you just wanna go back, um, let me see hit the oculus button okay so if you want to go over here you see your games uh among us vr and whatnot uh i think you can uh yeah there's some options here uh yeah you can mess around with this there's there's a, like you can switch screens and stuff um i'm not gonna go too deep in all the settings and whatnot so this is just a, a, a good tip on how to link it if you want to try new stuff, okay? I'm no expert here, but I'm just teaching you how to get it done. You do your own testing. But yeah, that's pretty much it. That's pretty much how you get it linked. And of course, whatever software you're using to record, um, you got a full screen capture. <laughs> it was full screen capture, okay? But yeah. All you need is a PC. You don't even have to have a, p a powerful PC. You don't need dual screen or anything. You just need a computer that is able to run uh, Streamlabs OBS or OBS. Um, mirror that screen and then get to recording. But yeah, that's how you get it linked and working. If you guys have any comments, uh, questions or comments down below, let me know. I'll try to reply to you guys. Um, I really appreciate the love and the support. Make sure you guys drop a like. Consider subscribing, all that good stuff. All right, see you guys in the next one.